the first and the foremost quality and the most important quality you need to have is a good voice, which is not actually your doing. You get it from God. That's God gifted. We always say we, she has or he has a God gifted voice. So that's the most important thing. And then intensive talim or to get a good guru or get a good teacher is also important because there are many people we see and they have good voice, but they've chosen a wrong teacher. So their voice is, you know, they cannot be that good or they cannot uh, attain that stage or that perfection. It was not possible. And also the practice. These three makes a good musician, not only a good vocalist. You can't start it uh, at a very, uh, you know, mature age. You have to be, your vocal cords have to be really tender and soft. So it is a, a difficult thing if you start doing it maybe at 20 or something. You have to start at 6. The paltas, you know. But this, I sing at a very high speed or a medium speed. The kid or the child who's coming for the first lesson will sing it. Maybe this speed. And then when he, he or she has mastered this speed, the teacher will say that you increase the speed. Next day she masters that. Next day the speed increases. Then more, 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 and then it increases to the optimum speed level. And then here you make the ornaments. And we have uh, paltas in different ornaments. When we get a palta, we first do it in sargam, of course. And then when uh, we can sing it the way uh, we can, then we go switch over to the akar. Yeah, akar should be afterwards. First, you know what you're singing. First, you have the grammar or the, you know, or the notations. You know what the what notations you're singing, and then you switch over to a. That's the best way. Then you then you don't make mistakes afterwards. I demonstrate the simple one. Sare sare ga re ga ma ga ma pa ma pa da pa da ni da ni sa ni sa re sa sa re sa ni sa ni da ni da pa da pa ma pa ma ga ma ga re ga re sa re sa sa re sa re ga re ga ma ga ma pa ma pa da pa da ni da ni sa ni sa re sa sa re sa ni sa ni da ni da pa da pa ma pa ma ga ma ga re ga re sa re like this. And first, it is not that I start in this speed. I can start in much slower speed, but then the speed increases. And this is the practice. There are so many different embellishments or ornaments found in music. Yeah, murki is ah, 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 this is what murki. If you sing the notation, it is sanirisa, pamadaba, sanirisa, ah, 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 ah. This is what is murki. Khatka is uh, more like ah, 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 but not so intricate like the murki. Ah, 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 pare, gamada, pa, pare, sa. It's a, uh, also like a, uh, glide, but mir is or glide is more, you know, slow. Ah, there should be no jerk. Khatka has a jerk, but mir has no jerk. Ah, no. ah. This is Khatka, and the other one is Meer without the Jir. It is a very old tradition of Indian music that we sit down in this posture, our legs crossed like this, and our spinal cord should be straight, and the whole, uh, you know, 
the voice also should come from this level not like uh, my head is drooping down or it is up like this it should be in this level and this is how we have seen all the stalwarts doing it this is how we have seen our teachers doing it and this is how we also do it so this is the tradition and i think this is um, this is the most scientific way of singing uh, the indian style of music when we stand i think the breathing is not that what we do when we are sitting you know we feel much more comfortable when we are sitting because our breathing is then in our control there is and there should be you know when you sing you should think that you are a woman and there a man is having his own expressions apart from the ornaments and the raga and um, the embellishments or whatever you are singing the alap and things like that are the same but still there are some ragas as well as there are some ornaments which mostly the men have mastered the woman and it doesn't suit also the women voice like too much of gamak ah, 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 ah. this doesn't suit woman voice so when uh, a woman is singing she should be careful that she shouldn't eat, uh, use too much of gama ah, 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 ah. i can sing it like that ah, 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 ah. If a man sings like that it will sound nice but if i sing like that it will not sound nice if i sing like ah, 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 it sounds much nicer so this is a basic difference between the woman's voice and a man's voice mm -hmm.